importantly, we got it done. We, we produced results. All of the great governors in this state had one common denominator. They were all about making progress. They were all about moving the ball forward. They were anti-gridlock, if you would. Uh, they would all, FDR, Teddy Roosevelt, uh, Rockefeller, Mario Cuomo, they would all talk about compromise to advance the goal. And inaction is the worst thing, and paralysis is the worst thing, and gridlock is the worst thing, and really the failure of government. And this budget moves the state forward. Over the past four years, we have moved the state forward. This state is a better state than it was four years ago. We started four years ago with this basic budget plan, 852,000 unemployed. Today, the state of New York has more private sector jobs than ever, period, period more jobs than ever. We went from a $10 billion deficit to a $2 billion surplus. Unemployment down in every region in the state. The state's energy is changing. People in upstate New York believing in their towns and believing in the trajectory of upstate New York again. So we have a lot to be proud of. It is not that we have accomplished everything. We have more to do. There's no doubt about that. Uh, and there are pieces of legislation that we would have liked to pass, that we did not get passed. Uh, so the work continues. Uh, I would have liked to see the DREAM Act pass. We need to do more on the, in the area of public finance, which has been an ongoing effort. We need to do more and uh, come to a resolution on teacher evaluations and what we're going to do with teacher evaluations. So we have more work to do, but uh, it's, it's been a, a great moment of progress and the state has made great strides. I credit my colleagues, I credit Senate Majority Leader Dean Skelos,